Like, bro, if you're trying to hold something, like, go buy some stocks. Man, we're so excited. We got some YouTube content coming out. Uh, we got a bunch of ideas, man. We got buyouts, uh, just the, the the conversation part of the buyouts, the relationship building part of the buyouts. We got some other stuff uh, that we got lined up, man. We'll show you guys when we show you. It's going to be funny. It's going to be interesting, man. Uh, just the culture, the whole culture when it comes to sneakers and, and everything, the urban, just fashion and haircuts, hip hop and, and just all that stuff, man. We got a lot of stuff stuff planned so uh tune in today we got a couple things planned maybe a couple buyouts and, and go to the uh, mall and talk to some people about sneakers uh but there's so much more in store man we love you guys stay tuned check it out i got a real quick question for you drew what do you think about these shoes right here man these things are nice that black that yellow it's not for me it's not too bright at least, you know? Yeah. So for me, like that black toe, it always goes hard, you know, it has a nice cut of leather, the off-whitish, you know? I, I'll say it's the best shoe of the... Oh ah, my God. Those things is... Oh. oh my... What do you gotta say about like, about Jordan just ruining shoes, like... I mean, they they gotta come out with just different colorways, so sometimes they try to just be different, you know, for a, for a woman, I think it's great, you know, for oh, a this, girl. This is a woman's shoe. Was. Well, <laughs> <and>, uh, <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> nah. But, but I'm saying, for a woman, it would be great, you know, but they gotta, they have so many colorways and so, so many, you know, so many releases that they're trying to keep up with because the demand is so high, so they gotta be creative, but... This was just a little too creative. Like I, I see the, I see the little like off-white little touch that they do right there, but and too then, much. Like, the glow on the stitching, like, does it glow in the dark or something? Nah, it's just bright. That highlighter, traffic worker type, construction worker type, yeah. bright. Like you could rock these with you, <laughs> go to go to work and work construction. I can, I can. Me personally, I just can't. Do it. You could be a high right, So we're here at, at the location and we're about to do the first buyout. And uh, the first pair that we got here is the uh, the yeah. shadows. Man, classic, classic, man. Just met my boy right here, Mark. He's got the bikes, though. Look at the bikes, though. That's what I really want. But yeah, man, we just, uh, you know, just keep it real. We just, you know, see what we can do. You know, obviously, like, I resell shoes, man. And, you know, he's a little uh, sneaker collector, too. Got a few pairs. So. I don't know, man, but uh, what'd you have a posted for? Obviously, you know, I, 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 had, I, I had those for 320 and I had those for 450 Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, those are cool prices. Yeah. If I bought them both, though, like, is there anything you could work, you know? Because uh, that's close to what I would buy. So, mm -hmm. you know, these, well, these, these are, are these. These. Yeah, those I see for use on, on StockX for up to like 499 almost. StockX? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, these I get for 400 mm -hmm. I think they're going to collapse together. Mm -hmm. Yeah, usually a little more than I'll pay just but it's a good shoe. That's why I like it. stuff yeah. like this like I'll pay yeah, just yeah, because yeah, I yeah. like to have like I didn't want to sell those something on this OG. Yeah, yeah that's going to go up. Shoes right there, bro. Hey, bro, I remember hey, you got them right now. Hey, yeah. bro, when these first came out, I remember I got like 20 pairs of these. Bro, I was selling them like at the time cuz I'm not one to really yeah, hold yeah. shoes like uh, oh, you know that's like even, now, even nowadays, like bro, like even now like someone's like oh hold the monkey like Bro, there's always gonna be something to hold. Like I'm those are holding them. I got my monkeys in there. Like personal, yeah. Me too. hold. I, I mean, like hold to resell. You know how oh, people okay, don't yeah. hold like 20 shoes. Like yeah, oh, these are gonna go up one day. Yeah. Like, bro, if you're trying to hold something, like go buy some stocks. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, like <laughs> shoes. Like, there's always gonna be something to flip. Yeah. I'm just like, I'm, a, I'm gonna flip it. You know, like, uh. But I was gonna say, like, I hope I sold these. Bro, I was selling them for retail. Like, like. 200 yeah, bucks bro. like the same when they were coming out now that it's crazy how, how much how expensive they got yeah those bro. are going up too bro yeah, yeah. Are skyrocketing right because i sold my pairs for like uh when i got them for like four four twenty i bought mine way over price oh so hurt what'd you buy i bought them uh to a guy who won the raffle oh wait like, like and what'd you pay i paid for 90. it's not bad yeah because yeah, yeah, uh you bought them in size eight yeah uh that's another thing, man. Yeah. I, like buying my size, man. I've been wanting this shoe like eight, 
What's that to you? Hey, hey. <laughs> Come up. <laughs> I was like, man, because I resell shit, but I'm like, you know? Yeah. Like, but, uh, the emotions start kicking in. I'm like, dang. That's right. You know, yeah. it's hard to buy. That's bro, it's hard usually, to I'm not gonna lie, like, if I'm in a shop, I've worked at shops, and I, yeah. my boy, I work with him, like, yeah. if these shoes were to come in the shop, you know, like, I would probably tell him, like, usually, like, stuff like this we're more flexible with, but, like, other stuff, it's like, dang, like, other stuff, like, if I'm gonna sell for two, three hundred, like, I'm gonna try to give you, like, 150, 200. Like, yeah, that's yeah, what yeah. I, you know, but stuff like this, it's a little bit better, like, yeah. you know, I don't mind making, you know, less money, like, mm -hmm. but, um, the other more reflective shoes out there, like, dang, like, Dang, you wouldn't discuss just this real stuff. They got the insoles in there? Yeah, they Oh, you replaced it? Oh, oh yeah, the original insole in my room. Oh, the original? I'm gonna take it out. Um, you're firm at 7? You mean at 680? Dang. That means you're basically getting these ones for like three something and those for less than 300. Because I'll probably sell these for like 283 myself. Yeah. That's what I was selling for. And then like these, I'm just, man, I'm just walking. I don't know if I'm going to sell the rock. I uh, buy these ones. These I'll sell for like three. If I sell them, I'll sell them for 382. So that's like 680. Okay, maybe at 650 then? That, 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 that shoe for three, I think 350? And then 250. Should be. Six hundred or six forty something. Because you said three fifty. No, I just about the one. It was six forty. You're gonna have it. Six fifty. Because you had this posted for how much? I had that book for four fifty. Yeah. Yeah. And that one was three twenty. Yeah. Yeah, so I had it for 280 and then 380. That's how yeah, I had yeah. it. Yeah. yeah 280. Probably sell, I'll push these myself at a, at the store, bro. Like 384. Yeah, like that's like. Uh, you can probably sell them on a shoe for more to be honest, man. Like I, there, it's out there. You go on these prices, you can find a way beat up, a way more beat up pair. So I thought I thought 450 is actually because I just sold a pair for like three. Yeah. Like, but it was a size nine. So four, like, how much off? You want to do anywhere close to five fifty? Nah, bro. I have to take some time. Just no bottom. You want to do? I'm just in the six hundred though. So like, that's the best I can do, bro. I guess. Bro. Will you do five eighty? I do something flat. That's a cousin, bro. Come on, bro. Hey, sneakerhead, sneakerhead, bro. You know you can do no, it. No, it's cool. Yeah, it's you know cool. Just because this shoe. This shoe's kind of like, and yeah. it's no box, you know? Yeah, yeah. I like, I got a nine and a half right now. I'm sitting on it. Yeah. For 280. I can't sit. Like, I'm sitting on it. Oh. And there's like this. You can't do 580, bro. What do you think? That's you. That's better than any shot will give you. I, trust me, I've worked at a lot of shots. 580, buy both of them right now. Cash. Yeah, I'll do it. All right, bro. You got the you. Yeah, I got you. Really? All right. Hey, bro. All right, look, check this out. I got a little, another off. 580? Uh -huh. And you let me ride the bike. <laughs> 580 and let me ride the bike. What about not 580 without the bike? <laughs> 580, no, that's not that. Ain't no, I'm really good. I'm oh, really good yeah. riding the bike. <laughs> So what are we up to now, man? We're about to um, talk to this dude about some black cement threes, man. Here he comes. Let's check it out. Let's do it. You good? Uh, from a shoe store at the liquor. Oh, you did? Yeah. How come you uh, you just bought them? Yeah. Well, it was my birthday. Oh, oh, that's dope. I always wanted Concords. Yeah. And I finally got some, so I'm just letting you know. Oh, you did? Let me see. Let me see. But how, why'd you buy these, bro? I don't know. They, was, they don't really have a lot of size nine, and they just had those. And I like. Oh, you know about these or no? How old are you? I'm really. I'm, uh, I just turned 15. How long you been buying shoes? Those are my first pair of Jordans. But do you know about this shoe though? Nah. This is like, bro, because for you to buy this for your first shoe, because a lot of kids like 
a lot of younger people like they don't they don't know about OG stuff, you know, like they just buy all the hype stuff. So it's cool that you got this shoe. Like this is a good shoe. How you doing? How you doing, man? Yeah, this is a good shoe. Like I was telling him, uh, we're doing YouTube stuff. Yeah, so YouTube we just content. record. He said it was okay. Oh, okay, you're not selling them, right? I'm about to sell them. Okay, uh, before you, if you, you sell them, I want you to cash. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they tried to get them before, dog, so I, I want to make sure. Oh, no, it's kind of, but are you firm at that price? Yeah, that's what I bought them for. For 260 But you bought them brand new or something? I think they're brand new. Oh, okay. Um, I wore them like this. Oh, okay, okay. You want to go lower on them? Go lower though. You couldn't get close to two for them, cause I'll, like I said, I'm not, I don't lie. Like I'll, I'll probably sell them for around two sixty, two eighty. That's what I would sell. For which I bought for like two. Maybe like. I'll do two ten. I mean, I'll go up ten bucks. I mean, because yeah. At least two thirty. So we're on our third bio and what's, what we're looking to get, to, man, we're about to get some uh, base size belugas, some, oh, the OG belugas, size seven, so let's see what we can do. I don't know if she's going to let me record her, but let's see what we do. I'll be back. I'll tell you guys how it goes. Man, we couldn't record that, man, um, but just know we got to steal on a good shoe, the beluga in a base size. You can't not find that shoe anymore. If you do, man, you're going to pay top dollar. This is gonna be the last bite out of the day. We've been out here for five hours and we're finally getting to the point where we gotta end the vlog real quick. But what, what do we got in store for these people? Man, we got a, a, a Yeezy 700 and then we got an OG Nike SB. Stay tuned for which one. Hey, but these don't have the box? No, they don't. But Damn. these are the Nike SB Gibsons. Bro, but you, you're old? I'm 23. But these came out in 07. So you were like, you bought them? In well, 07? No, I didn't buy them in 07. Oh, okay, okay, okay. No, I bought them when I was younger, though. Okay, because I used to, uh, I grew up, are you a sneakerhead or are you just... Somewhat, somewhat. Because I, bro, like when I, 07, I was in high school. Dang. Uh, I was in high school, so like I bought these from when, from the store, oh, okay. bro. That's when they were like, you know. Bro, like, bro, you could go into the shop and buy like two, three pairs, like. Yeah, like nothing. Like nothing, bro. Like, you you know, active? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Bro, active, like, bro, I, I used to go to the first one. They'd be having uh, sidewalk sales and all the SVs would be out there, bro. Dunks, hey. like purple pitch, yeah, like everything. $95 bro, like cheap, bro. Uh, they're like, yeah, they're used up. Yeah, they're, they're used up. Just the set, this is, they're not bad like this, just this is like the main thing right here, though. Yeah. The sole separation. Okay. Yeah, there's a little going on. Oh, yeah, this one's a little worse, though. The gas fuse. That's just a hard shoe because, uh, like with yeah, stuff like that, there. it's just a hard shoe because like it's so rare, so it doesn't really sell that much. Mm -hmm. So it's hard to get like a like a yeah, quote, sure, you know, yeah. like yeah, but they for sure uh, grab attention at, though, I'll tell you that much. Cause you said they were how much? They're like around six, seven hundred, something like that. Yeah, good. But like those are the recent sales, three sixty, three ninety. That's brand new. Yours, what size are they? Okay, these are 10. Yeah, so three, that's what they sell for brand new. Brand new. Yeah, I could get a new pair right now for like, no ass, but the highest bid, that's, that's, anyone can ask whatever they want. That's mm -hmm. what some, 
But that's what that's what sends you on the camera. Oh, then I, yeah. Then I go to all sales. Those ones like same thing. Those are just not as good condition as I yeah. thought. Let me see. Man, just like. Hey, I'm, man, these are these are good shoes. All all of them are good shoes. But even these ones, like brand new. What size is it? Uh, they are nine and a half. What would you take right now? Cause we're kind of like off. Like what you told me originally, mm -hmm. like for that one, Brandon. You seen with the black one, uh, Gasper. Yeah, yeah. I'm but I like Nike SB, and then the brown ones, kind of like just a lot more worn than I thought. And then these ones, like they're not as much as you said. You know, they're going for cheaper than yeah. what you pay for. So like, I don't know. I could probably, Obviously, I resell shoes, so like, yeah. I'm like, you know, like. I mean, my good. I have someone who wanted to buy them already. I could let these go for like 200. No, I'll well, that's let, probably what I'll I'll let the gas fees like. also go with that 200. You can't do anywhere close to four though. Just cause this, that's not good. I'll do 450. Did you do 420? And I came from San Bernardino. Yeah, fuck yeah. All right, yeah. I'll do 420. Nah, but so we um we did all right, you know. Um, so our first buy, we did some breads and some shadows, some OG stuff, bread 11s. I know everyone. If you collect sneakers, you gotta know what the bread 11s are. So we got these shadows, both size eight. Our other bio, man, same thing. OG, black cement three. We did all right with this one too. What do you what do you guys say to people like people? I feel like people are forgetting about this shoe. Like people are sleeping on it. Man, it's just one of Jordan's original colorway shoes when he just was coming out with the shoes. That was like that was one of the original just the OGs. OGs. OG sneaker way. Next bio, man, we bought uh, we got a little clip deal from somebody uh, man my personal favorites man uh, we got some Azras, some 700s the best colorway to me that's not my, that's not the personal favorite I'm talking about uh, yeah. and then we got these the Gasparillas Nike SBs I love you know I grew up on Nike SBs so but this is my personal favorite right here man 2007 Nike SB, that brown colorway with the fat OG tongue, that classic SB tongue, um, just with that brown with the with the purple fur. When I was young, you know, I would have done. I don't know. I'll still do it every now and then. Uh, but when I was young, this was like, man, one of my favorite shoes back in the day. Right man. The Gibson Nike SB dunk, and then the steel of the day. I waited till the end. Man, we got base size Beluga, the OG like. Man, there you go. It's kind of hard to see, but you guys get the gist of it. There you go. So those were our bios for the day. You know, we just went randomly. We got some stuff. Um, some things didn't go through. We had some things and they fell off. Uh, but we still kept on grinding and we hustled and we, we came away with some steals and some some good OG stuff and, and just a good variety of stuff. It was, it was a cool day. Definitely, I can't agree. It's just... The, the content that we're about to provide is just very like, um, like when he was, we we're talking in the car, and it's like, it's gonna bring it, bring it back to like the roots of how sneaker collecting or sneaker buying was, you know, like I know you could explain more on, on that subject, and it's just, um, it's pretty like interesting to see how, how buying sneakers could like get you connections and stuff like that. And look what we did here today, it's just it's something, something uh, I hope you guys will like and hope you guys will stay tuned. Um, we're gonna we're gonna continue to be making more content about sneaker the sneaker culture and uh, things very similar to this. We have a lot of ideas coming your way.